Imagine next turns on the adventure. Series four blowing bags, let's open them. Okay, little dude said it all. We have series four Imagine X blind bags. Now, usually at the beginning of our Imagine X blind bag videos, we like to introduce our old Imagine X figures to the new bags, but we'll just get straight to it. And I think what we're gonna do this time is do them in the order of the codes if I can find the codes. We were only able to find eight different codes, so hopefully there are only eight and we didn't miss out on any, but if you know, comment down below. And the codes start with 71. So let's see what's inside bag number 71. And we got the snowboarder. Snowboarder, all right. Now one of the big things you hear in the um, previous Imagine X series is that there are no females and it looks like the snowboarder is indeed a girl. So she comes with a pink snowboard and a snowboarding jacket. What do you think? Good. She's ready to rip it up and I don't know what you do in the snow. Do you shred it? Anyway, here's number 71 of the new Imagine X series. Before we open up the next blind bag, let's take a look. It shows eight on the flyer, so hopefully we got everybody. Here is 72. By the way, we're looking at the codes up here on the back of the bag, up here on the corner. So if there's a figure you want, that is where you look to find the code. It's a witch, like from Wicked. So her hat, she has a face attached to it. So you actually get to change out her face. So she has a regular Imagine X figure face and then a witch face. And a broom she can ride is what she comes with. <laughs> So the first two that we opened were the girls from this round. They did 71 and 72 for the girls and then they skipped to 78. So that's weird. They still kind of even separated the girls. And we got a wrestler. A boxer. I used to confuse wrestling and boxing when I was a kid too, but it is a boxer. <laughs> I don't think that's what you're supposed to do with that. <laughs> it's a trophy. Actually, it's what he boxes. Is that the only accessory he comes with? Yes, that is the only accessory he comes with. And in here, it's a brown one, but he actually got a gray one. Okay, punch it. <laughs> Woo, he's missing a tooth and he has a big old shiner and some spots under that eye and a band-aid. So lots of detail here. Oh, and he has a tattoo. It says mom. And then he can <coughs> punch this thing. <coughs> Practicing. Next in line is 77, so that means the boxer was 76. We got this guy. Oh, cool. That is a Planet of the Apes looking fella. He comes with a space gun. Let's see a space gun. Pew, 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 pew. He probably shoots lasers from that. So his space helmet is not see-through. It's just a gold paint. And then there he is with his head. So he's a space monkey, most closely identifiable as maybe a Planet of the Apes inspired figure. Okay, we're moving on now to 79. Wow, let's do it. He's like a cross between those two, the snowboarder and the space monkey, because he is like a space snowboarder. So he comes with this little surfboard that he can fly through the air, and he's got skinny little robot legs. And then if you pop off his helmet, you can see that he looks almost a little bit like Bender, maybe. He's some kind of robot alien, and his <laughs> clear helmet has Viking horns. This is an interesting one. Oh, little dude. You had his helmet on backwards, I think. So here is this one. This one looks a lot like something you would see in the regular Imagine X figures, not necessarily a blind bag one. Okay. All right. Okay, here is a little balloon animal that comes with the clown. And he also comes with, oh, a vest with his creepy clown yeah. hair attached to it. So it's all red and it has hair. He can hold the balloon animal, but only by the body. It's the only narrow enough part for him to grab onto. So I personally have a strong distaste of clowns, but this is a pretty cool figure. There you go. The stalker guy. That's actually basketball. Interesting. Looks like it. So this is a little confusing at first that he comes with a stand because no other figures come with one. But then once you put him on there, you realize the stand is so that he can make a slam dunk. So here he is. There's almost always a sports guy in the Imagine X blind bags. And this time it happens to be basketball. I'm playing basketball. Slam dunk. Last Last one, it's number 82. And a different guy. 
Mad scientist of some sort? Mad scientist. How do you I don't think he holds that. Okay, and this one is another very typical Imagine Next Fair, in my opinion. He is a mad scientist with some crazy silver hair on a crazy looking face, too. Crazy silver beard. And then his, woo, peekaboo, I see you in there. Accessory is a gas mask that goes over his head and a little backpack with a trench coat of some sort. And this little lab table that he can do his mad scientist activities at. Okay, here are all of the series four Imagine Next blind bags. As always, we cannot wait for series five. I think from this round, my favorite's gonna be maybe the Space Monkey. I see Space Monkey too. I'm not big into sports, but the basketball player is pretty cool that he's doing a slam dunk. And I like the witch. She's pretty cool that she has a different face. I would like to see that in more Imagine Next characters. Why don't you comment down below which one is your favorite from series four and comment what you would like to see in series five. There's a lot more Imagine Next toys over on our channel. And thanks as always for watching Dudes in Toyland. <laughs> Imagine next, imagine next, turn on the adventure of Imagine next.